data that we've um, received um, for our country, we have shared it with our uh, our government officials. We have also shared the data with our parents, as well as the children, and um, our teachers, uh, mainly our senior teachers, because um, the seniors are the ones that were tested. And the data was shared with parents especially, so that they would be able to um, see where their children did well, and see where the areas in which um, we can gauge their support to um, help us to improve in our children learning and also we're able to use the data to um, some extent to uh, inform our planning for our curriculum for our annual um, learning for the students. Um, first of all, I felt that the benchmarks were done really well and I commend the people that um, all assisted in producing the benchmarks. Also because it now gives us a range of levels in which we can actually uh, measure our children against as from year two up to year eight. That was something that stood out to me because we are always looking at better ways in which we can show the progression of our children's learning. Um, uh, for the lower secondary uh, assessment that we were talking about today, um, I feel that that is also a good um, measure that we are going to be doing, or a good pilot. That's why Niwe put up their hand to be one of the pilot schools next year, because I feel it will be beneficial for our children. Um, as well as the children around the Pacific so that we are able as um, leaders of the Pacific to better provide programs that will be beneficial regardless of where your position is in the region. It will assist all children. <music>